Um, okay, so drag has always, and our just our very lives have been political by nature, mm -hmm. and drag was almost created as a as a protest to that. Where do you see the future of drag, just based on like where the country is going, the direction that we're going in, whether positive or negative? What's what's the future of drag in context of like protest? You know, we're finding out that as people are now, for some reason, thinking that drag is a new phenomenon and actually fighting against it when it's been around for many, many years, it's not a new concept, that even though there's a lot of pushback, there's significantly more support and, and people that are trying to fight for what's right. We've seen drag bans not actually pass We've seen uh, bills against transgender individuals not actually go through, and we've seen the opposite as well. So I would say, what I would hope for in the future is that people realize that of all the things to be worried about, of all of the things to uh, to step up and fight for, that they'll realize that health care, that child care, that um, that infrastructure, other other concepts are significantly more powerful than dra banning drag story time or banning drag existing in the world. That mm -hmm. we're not the real problem. Maybe guns are, or something mm -hmm. of a of a larger issue. Um, that's where my hope for the nation is. And we've seen that even even in places like Nashville and in Florida that those bills against drag queens or drag artists aren't followed through on and we're still existing and continuing to do shows and continuing to protest by yeah. existing. That's wonderful. Thank you. Yeah, that was a great question.